The big political story we're tracking this Friday, a day after the Congress leadership accused the Modi government of decimating the contribution of Jawaharlal Nehru. The centre is all set to kickstart celebrations for Nehru's 125th birth anniversary today. In the absence of Prime Minister Modi, Home Minister Rajnath Singh released, uh, is expected to release coins at a function at uh, the Nehru Memorial to mark the anniversary. Finance Minister Arun Jaitley will also inaugurate a children's film festival at Sri Fort Auditorium today. He is also expected to speak on Nehru and his legacy on the occasion. Union Minister Menika Gandhi will launch Bal Swachita Mission which uh, has been organized in schools between the 14th and 19th of November. The government has also planned to celebrate Nehru's 125th birth anniversary as the year of Bal Swachita. Congress meanwhile kick-started its celebrations at uh, New Delhi Salkatura Stadium on Thursday. Sonia Gandhi also administered a pledge to the assembled Congress leaders to uphold Nehru's egalitarian ideology. Let's get an award from our correspondent Ashish Merishi who is with us live from the national capital this morning. Ashish, day two of legacy was after Congress's grand beginning yesterday. The BJP government set to launch its celebrations starting with the Home Minister Rajnath Singh unveiling coins. Very true. In fact, Simi, you know, in fact, the, at 11 a.m. is the event when Rajnath Singh will be there. But then we have to go back uh, to a few days back then where, you know, the flare-up started. If you remember, uh, the, the death anniversary of Indira Gandhi was used as, uh, you know, it, it was eclipsed by the, the government celebrations of Sardar Vallabhai Patel's birth anniversary. So in totality, we, we have seen the way, uh, you know, the BJP government has worked, uh, you know, uh, in appropriating legacy. But uh, yes, now we, we know... Uh, uh, you know, the Congress, the way the celebrations uh, started uh, as far as the Nehru, Jawaharlal Nehru's uh, birth anniversary, uh, that is today, and the event uh, started yesterday itself, uh, Simi. And we've seen, you know, the, the yesterday's event was basically, you know, organized by the by the Delhi committee. Uh, and But we know that there is another committee, uh, you know, which is which is headed by the Prime Minister, in, uh, you know, which, is, which, is, which looks after the celebration. But then the Congress had its own committee headed by uh, Sheila Dixit. But now, uh, uh, as we know, uh, you know, uh, this is also being used as a platform to, to get the like-minded people and we, we know that, you know, now the Congress has invited Mamta Banerjee and we know uh, that Mamta Banerjee and BJP are head-on as of now in, in, in West Bengal. So certainly this, this platform of, of, uh, uh, of, the, of the celebrations of Jawaharlal Nehru's birth anniversary is actually being used as, you know, a, a, a conglomerate, a platform uh, to, to certainly get, you know, the like-minded people uh, at one place and uh, certainly you know, Delhi elections are not very far off. So certainly, the Congress is also using this uh, platform to to uh, to get you know their gears up, so that uh, you know they can show that the cadre is still there. They're fighting the elections and they're trying to come back. And Jawaharlal Nehru's uh, birth anniversary being politicised both by the BJP and uh, the Congress. Ashish Maheshi, thanks so much for that update.